Digital disruption. I think of it as the impact of smack it. Social, mobile, analytics, cloud, internet of things. And a whole set of technologies that have followed that, including cognitive computing and biometrics. It is like it sounds, alarming, powerful, disruptive. And we understand now that basically it's going to change your entire competitive landscape and it's going to change in, in at least one of two ways. Either it will disrupt your customer relationships and new companies will come in and provide much better customer engagement, customer experience than you are with your products, and or it's going to change the value proposition of your product because your product can be wrapped in products and in information and services in ways it never could be before. Those are the two challenges. What do you do to address that in a word? integration. Take everything your business does and deliver it as a whole and you will have a much more viable product and you will have a much richer customer experience. But it's a hard place to get to. So let me pr uh, propose five things for you as you go on this journey. Number one, don't hire a chief digital officer. And I don't mean forever. But I do mean don't rush out and hire one today because the first thing people need to understand in your company is that digital is everybody's job, not the job of the chief digital officer. Once everybody embraces this, then you'll find you need somebody in charge of coordinating all the activities. That's when you hire your CDO. Two, organizational surgery is now mandatory. This is because we can't just fix little things that are wrong. We have to completely rethink how we do business. This will mean more empowered people. It will mean much more synchronization of the organization's activities. No more silos. Three, value chains are becoming irrelevant. So stop worrying about starting and ending points. Think of the confluence of things that you need to do and then think in terms of synchronizing those activities. Four, get a digitized platform. Where people are not adding value, they are probably adding non-value added complexity. Address that by wiring in the end-to-end -end processes that simply don't need to be handled by humans. Fifth, focus on solutions, not products. This will mean identifying problems that your customers don't even know they have. If you start to address those five things, I not only think you can succeed in the digital economy, I think you can have a great deal of fun. And I think that's what we're going to find in the midst of all this digital disruption.